Hi friends, this is MD Vegan. Yeah, today I got something very nice for you. It's actually an Ahimsa trap. No, no, no. Oh, how could I say that? Not a trap. That is such a rude expression. Not a trap. An Ahimsa um, way to free fruit flies. Everybody knows fruit flies, you know? And they are, to sometimes, they seem to be a, like a plague. But what did they do? They just have, uh, just have enjoying the sweet fruit in our kitchen. <laughs> and just the happy, happy beings and they don't do anything else. They don't harm anybody, actually. And um, if the fruit is especially ripe, they would come and everybody knows, I'm sure, <laughs> that they don't keep fruit out of the, out of the sink, they put it into the refrigerator to keep the fruit flies off and all these things. But we don't need to do that anymore. Because they have a nice trick, and I call it the fruit fly hotel, hotel fruit fly, fruit fly. <laughs> and it is an amazing simple trick and it works and it, they have even much fun about it. I take them out, first I, I invite them in the hotel, they happily join, all together, takes only a couple of hours, they are all in, no one will remain outside because it's so much fun inside that hotel. I take the hotel, bring it out of the garden, open it, and they're free, they fly, they fly away. And they are so happy. You can, I will show you in a moment what they do actually, how they sing and dance um, when they are in the hotel. But first I show you how to make that hotel. First I have a little glass here, that's to store some things, items for the, from the kitchen. Usually there's a lid on top, I take it off, of course I don't need it now. And this wonderful glass. This is a beautiful hotel for the fruit flies. It's, and uh, on, on the bottom of the, of, the, of the hotel, the glass, I put um, a paper towel like this. It can take a lot of water and liquid. And that is important because if I put the fruit, I need some. I need a sour and a, a sweet fruit. Friend of my face, a Facebook friend. I don't know her really, but just on Facebook, she told me. Um, that we just need to have a sweet fruit and a sour fruit to get the little friends excited. I have here an apple, very inexpensive, and a lemon. Very common and regular fruit, easy available. I just put a little piece of a lemon here, just I already cut one, put it onto the paper towel, and the same I cut an apple, just a little piece, doesn't need to be much, only so that the, that the little guys can begin to smell it and um, they feel attracted. They don't, they don't need a lot, they just need a little bit, as we all know. The tiny little bit will be enough and they will be already there. Yeah, that's what I have here. Just a little snack for them and they will all rush in. And now, the trick. <coughs> the trick. I need a little a fold here, a fold foil here. It's a uh, a nice little foil, just here I scratch, I take a little piece from the, yeah, that should be enough, from the roll, put it on top of the lid of the glass, instead of a lid, and finally I take a little rubber band, you have always a collection of rubber bands here, then I get some herbs in the, in the health food shop, I, they are almost always fixed with a, with a rubber band. I collect them, so I don't need to buy any uh, extra. So I always have them on store, <coughs> easy. These glasses are very versatile in the kitchen. Yeah. So I put the little rubber band to close the glass. See, here, that's what it is firmly closed now. That wouldn't work because they wouldn't get in through this. So for this one, for this, the girl told me, the lady told me to put this here to make some holes. I just put in the knife, turn around a little bit to make lock, lock the, the hole a little bit bigger. You see, like this. Need to be enough. They can get in and out, that's important. You don't want to catch them or put them in a trap like a mouse or so. 
as some will do here. This is enough. They're big enough for them to get in and out. And you won't believe it. I didn't believe it worked. I thought, okay, a nice trick, I will try it. Give it a try, give it a chance. I thought, well, okay, the fruit flies, who will, um, who will help? Uh, I don't believe it, but... And in a moment, I show you what happened to the fruit flies with this. In a second, I'm back. Now look at this. This is my glass, my hotel. You see them inside, and see the fruit on top. They allow the fruit had a little wasted. It is a had been a mango this time. I had a, a piece of mango left over. It's turned dark now. I will set them free in a moment, and you will witness it. But before I do that, you must hear. You see the holes inside or in the top, and they can get in and out, and they do so. Some of them get out. They have a little. Um, uh, a little fun time outside of the hotel and then they go back into the hotel. But most of them will stay here all the time. So they're not trapped. They're not in a prison. Of course they can get out. That's important. And now I show you. I put this onto the microphone, close to the microphone so you can listen, actually listen, what they are dancing and singing, how they are singing. It's so loud. It's so loud. It's amazing. <laughs> so here. You should be able to hear it. Can you hear it? Isn't that amazing? I mean, I'm so excited, you see. Okay, I'm not easy one to be excited. I'm always excited. But this one really kept me off balance. And I will bring them out into the garden. And I'll show you what, what happens when I set them free. It's in a minute, they're all away, gone. And for the rest of the time, for the next time, they will be here, the other friends of them. So, because they kind of thing, will be new ones. I don't know where they come from. Suddenly they appear of nothing. My fruit is still on the sink on the table in the kitchen openly, but no fruit flies anymore around. They all want prefer this place. <laughs> okay, see in a moment. I see you in the garden and I show you when I set them free, okay? <laughs> Hi, there I am. There we are. You know what happened? I actually wanted to show you the moment when I released them. But at the same moment when I put them out here in the garden, here the little glass, the little hotel, they have already gone. And you see, that proves that they really are free to go and to leave. As soon as they were in the garden, they left the place. See, I opened it now, and the remaining ones, only three or four are left. <laughs> see? No more fruit flies. The, left, the last one left already. Well, two or three are in there. Some, uh, <laughs> some late guys are still there, they prefer to stay in there. But most of them, as soon as they stood there, went through the holes. So, yeah, it's true. They are not trapped. They are not imprisoned. And isn't it wonderful? They leave the moment they come out into the, to the garden. While inside the kitchen, near the fruit, the other fruit, they would prefer this place. Isn't it wonderful? So they know what's good. They know really what's good. And we should treat them with the same respect as every other human being and animal. See you soon. Yeah, you can subscribe. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> you can subscribe to MD Vegan on YouTube. It's my channel. And have another video every single day. Most of the time I will send recipes, but once in a while, like today, a practical tip for the kitchen. See you soon.